Good afternoon, this is Todd Horwitz coming up from the floor of the CME Group in Chicago and as we continue to track the, uh, the uh, Euro currency, uh, what we're seeing here now is, is what looks to see a much stronger euro against a much weaker dollar. And of course, that is uh, pushing, uh, pushing the euro higher and the dollar lower. And what we're going to see here, this has got a lot to do with the debt markets as we continue to see the, the Fed try to push rates down, which, is, is, which weakens the dollar automatically. And of course, what we're really seeing here is, I think, a pretty good short squeeze. And what we're looking for here as it finishes, if you remember, our original target here was about 122, which is where we want to be sellers at 122. The, the entire picture does not look really well. And I think what you're going to see here is as the models start to change, you're going to start to see some heavy pressure and heavy selling coming in in the euro at about the 122 level, if not before. We've been trying to sell them on the way up. And of course, now we actually want to you know, sell more in earnest here as we look for a, a pretty precipitous drop that we should see based on what's happening. And of course, you can't you know, they, as they've tried to push and force the dollar down, obviously, euro currency goes up and it's going to be a, a model that I think is going to immediately turn around as we look for the dollar to start to gain some strength as interest rates will rise out of pure uh, growth and other things that's going to push dollars higher. So I think you look to be a seller about that 122 level. I think that's really the, the, the home run number that we'll be looking for. And if we can get there, we'll go ahead and, and push them down. And I think we're going to see a pretty sharp move on the first part down. But now we're going to target back down around 116 first, and then we'll look for a little bit of a bounce and then go lower from there. But at the end of the day, with the jobs coming out Friday and everything else going on, I think you're going to see a much stronger dollar coming up here nearly, which would push a lot of pressure on the euro currency. And that's the way I see it. This is Todd Horwitz coming up to the floor of the CME Group in Chicago.